What's up, guys? I think this is going to be my uh, first video from the home workshop here. Hey, look what's on TV. Well, those of you guys that live in Ohio, you know it's October, right? Cold weather's coming. And with it's going to come the snow. So, I thought today I'd show you guys how to make a cheap set of snow chains. My tires are really dirty, so I'm going to get these uh, off of here and get them cleaned up, and I will be right back. Okay, so here's what we're going to need for this project. A couple pairs of pliers. I use one needle nose and one regular plier. And I bought uh, 10 feet of number 14 10-pound jack chain. I got 10 feet of it for 5 bucks at Home Depot. It's really cheap. Tires are all clean now. Seems like I brought home a... Uh, truckload of sand from our last outing at Flat Rocks. Kind of funny, but a little messy. All right, let's get to work. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is figure out how much chain you want on the inside of your wheel. And I'm just draping it around and estimating. that point I'm going to give it 11 and a half inches and you want to do that inside and out on all four tires you're going to have eight pieces at 11 inches Now from here, you want to link one end to the other end. Close that link up. Good and snug so it can't come back off again. Close this one off. Next, <clears throat> we'll be finding out how much chain we need to go from the inside to the outside of the tire. Okay, so I measured from the inside ring to the outside ring, or vice versa. And it's looking like four and a half inches is where I need to be at. So I'm going to go ahead and put that on now and let you see what it looks like. bit of trial and error, I've got this. At this point, I know four and a half inches on this side is much too much. So I'm going to take some of that off of there and let you know what, what the uh, dimensions are. Be right back. All right, so as it turns out, three inches three and a half inches I'm sorry was perfect from side to side nice and tight but not too tight still a little bit of play in there and you got something that looks like that now from here you can go ahead and go hog wild and add more chains to it as many as you like just make sure you put one on each side and that is how you do tire chains 
Later. So keep in mind guys, I have never built these before, I've never tried to do this before, my very first attempt. Not too bad, not too shabby I don't think. Looks like they will serve a purpose. But I started off with 10 feet of this chain, I've used half of it. So if you're going to do all four tires on two twos, you're going to need about 20 feet of this stuff. Let me know what you think. Later.